semi truck crash just off the side of I 5 at US 2 smashed into several RVs in Grand Mound. King 5's Carol Fallen just got there on the scene to tell us what the latest is there right now. Kara, good morning. Yeah, good morning. You can see this is the aftermath of that crash that happened here. You can see the semi truck is still here on its side. Uh, the manager here at this RV uh, dealership told us that the guy who was driving actually climbed out of the top here of this semi truck. You can see a lot left over. It's going to take a while to get all this out of here. The manager was actually just 40 to 50 feet away in one of his own trailers. He was watching all of this happen from the window. This happened just before five o'clock this morning. Um, a semi truck driver went off of the highway into Blair's I-5 RVs here in Rochester. So this was northbound I-5 near exit 88. West Thurston Fire Crew say the driver hit three to four RVs and a tiny home. The driver was taken to the hospital with minor injuries, although the manager says he looked pretty scraped up when he climbed uh, out of the semi truck. He also said that he didn't hear any brakes at all, so he hit the floor uh, the second he heard this all happening. He didn't hear any brakes, so he suspects that the driver might have fallen asleep. But of course, we're still waiting on details from Washington State Patrol. They are out here investigating what happened here this morning. Luckily, other than the driver that was sent to the hospital with minor injuries, no one else was hurt. Once we have more details, we'll let you know uh, the very latest on King5.com. Live here near I-5, Kiara L. Fallen. King5 Look News. at all the damage mm -hmm. there. That had to be quite the incident when it happened. Yeah, Kira. scary situation for that driver, oh, thank too. Thank you.